The brightness button is used to open a slider. With the aid of the slider, you can digitally adjust the brightness of the camera image. Any position on the repeat can be saved as the master image. This master image is used as a reference image for the operator and can be displayed in a window that can be moved during web inspection. In this way, you can compare the print image with the reference image at any time and check the current print quality. In order to create a new master image, you have to move the camera to the position in question first. The master image window is displayed when the master image button is pressed. When you press the master image button once more, this time in the master image window, a green frame is displayed. The cursor must be moved into the frame for positioning. Then you can shift the frame by clicking and dragging the left mouse button. The size of the frame can be changed using the light blue square. The Save Master Image button saves the section of the image selected as the master image. The position of the image is saved too. The master image is displayed in the master image window. You can move the master image on the monitor by clicking and dragging with the left mouse button. Double clicking on the master image will hide the surrounding window. Only the image itself will be visible on a scale of 1 to 1. Now you can continuously compare the current production with the master image. In order to hide the master image, press the master image button in the additional function block again. The master image window is then closed. The show grid button displays two vertical measuring lines two horizontal measuring lines and a dimension grid. You can move the measuring lines to any position using the mouse. Now we move the left vertical line, then the right vertical line. On the top of the window, the position on the repeat and the distance between the two lines are displayed. The same can be done with the horizontal lines. Again, the position on the repeat and the distance between the two lines are displayed. Based on the histogram, you can monitor the RGB values in a certain section of the image. In order to define the image section for which a histogram is to be created, Press the histogram button first. The histogram window and a green frame are displayed. The frame defines the area in which the color is to be analyzed. The cursor must be moved into the frame for positioning. Then you can shift the frame by clicking and dragging with the left mouse button held down. The size of the frame can be changed using the light blue square. The histogram is updated immediately. The red, green and blue portions of the section of the image are displayed as numerical values under the histogram. If you click on the cross in the upper right corner of the histogram window, the histogram will close again. To delete the repeat overview, click on this button. Then all the images around the current camera image are deleted.